While most people are out there building setups for damage output, I'm here with a fun build. How about a Zane build with up to 9 drones to accompany you into battle? How's it going guys? My name's DPJ and I'd like to thank you for stopping by and checking out my video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like really helps out and subscribe if you want to see more Borderlands. Also guys, as usual, I'm giving away copies of Borderlands to win one for yourself or a friend. Simply subscribe and make sure you have notifications turned on. Drop a like on this video and leave a comment down below. Okay, so this build in reality only consists of you having to use a certain few things. And as a matter of fact, you can still build a damage build around this if you wanted to. That's entirely up to you. So we all know Zane has his drone action skill, but there are certain items and means which provide you additional drones and on Zane there are ways to spawn even more of said drones in. So this is what you need. The messy breakup shield. This shield is a must. You are accompanied by a small drone that will fire at enemies. When your shield breaks you get another drone come to help. You also need this infiltrator class mod. Benefit perks wise ain't important, it's a stat in which on action skill start, it breaks your shield. That's the important thing here, that's what we need. This paired with that shield mod, and when you have that sentinel action skill selected, this means upon using your action skill you have 3 drones following you around. 2 from your shield and 1 from your action skill sentinel drone. But you can also get 2 more. Zane can use two action skills, as we all know, at the same time. So for your second one, you want to use Digiclone. Upon spawning your Digiclone, he also has a drone. And again, when your Digiclone shield breaks, another drone comes in to help. So here right now, there are five drones. Now using the 10 gallon TDO will drop a legendary means you can spawn in even more. As on reload, you throw out a drone which will follow you around and shoot at enemies. If you have more than one 10 gallon equipped, you can swap between them and throw them out to have a total of 9 drones with this setup. Or by using one 10 gallon and using other TDO weapons, which can help as they all spawn in additional drones. Some run along the floor, some bounce, some stick to walls, some do other things. But yeah, they all will help. Now I will state obviously drones don't last too long, but amongst a battle with a mob of enemies, they do do their part and indeed will last a long enough. Now your skill build for this obviously you have to be using two action skills, the sentinel and the digiclone. Only other perks I suggest you use from these skill trees are these, death follows close which is always a must, good misfortune which is great for this as it allows your action skills to last longer amongst the battle, and quick breather, whenever Zane swaps with his digiclone his shield starts regening, because your class mod breaks your shield this is decent for those sticky situations. But other than that guys, the rest is really up to you. I myself use this build which was shown to me by my pal, which you guys can copy if you like, or you could even possibly make it even better. That's completely up to you. So yeah guys, this is the 9 drone Zane build. Just a fun build for those out there looking to have a great time. I do have an amazing after patch Zane build coming, which concentrates on weapon damage output due to the recent anointed weapon buff on Zane, so stay tuned for that. So yeah guys, I hope you enjoy this one. And on that note, we have come to the end. If you enjoyed it, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more Borderlands videos, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.